Straveti Priateli, welcome back to A Taste of Bulgaria with me, Gareth. So you've decided to visit Varna in Bulgaria. Great choice. But you just don't know what the accommodation is going to be like. So in this video, I'm going to show you... Okay, so we're just on the pedestrian, the main pedestrian street here, and I found a little hostel. Nice, perfect position, and the name of the hostel is uh, Musala. Yeah. And I'm here with the owner, and your name is sir? Boyan. Boyan. And how many years have you been open here? Well, already four years. Four years? <laughs> business is good, you... No. <laughs> no? Obviously since, now... Since one year. Since one year is really good. bad. Yeah. What kind of guests do you usually get? Well, I can say that this is the best hostel in Varna. Yeah. Two-stars hostel. Two-star uh, hostel. Uh, there is a mixed service. Uh, one of the rooms is uh, like a hostel, the other is like a hotel. Yeah. There is an apartment. Uh -huh. So uh, our guests uh, are mixed. There, of course, there is uh, a lot of young people who are traveling. Yes, uh, yes. Backpackers, backpackers exactly, yeah, yeah. usually. But uh, we have also business travelers and families who are coming here because of the beach or because of the uh, tourists. Tourists, yeah, yeah. There's a lot to do in Varna. Uh, generally, so off season, how much is it generally for a room? Let's say a dorm room. Uh, this middle season, yes. for example, yes. uh, the price of the, for the bed in the dorm room. Yes. It's uh, seven euro. Seven euro. Yeah. For the private room, yep. it's uh, fifteen euro. For the apartment, it's uh, thirty euro. Thirty euro. Something like that. Oh, that's very good. And uh, you provide a, a breakfast here? Yeah. 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 We provide. And that's breakfast. an extra charge. Extra charge. Yeah. yeah. And then in the mid, like really the high season, how much is it generally? Generally double. Double. Yeah. About double. Okay. So I think that's really good because the position of this place, you're right on the pedestrian street, you can go shopping, you've got the uh, sea garden just over there and the beach, the port, it's just a five minutes walk away. And who did you say this gentleman was here? Well, this is one of the famous architects in uh, Bulgaria. He designed more than 400 buildings. 400 buildings? Yeah, and uh, yeah. one of... Uh, his, uh, and the name of this gentleman is? Uh, Dapko Dapkov. Dapko Dapkov. Dapko Dapkov. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. The, the, very interesting story about this building. Yeah. Because uh, the owner of the land uh, right. showed him the picture of the White Island building in New York. Right. I said, I want this building here. Ah, that's <laughs> nice. Yeah, 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 it kind of does have that look yeah, about yeah, that yeah. building here. Yeah. Yeah. The architect said, but I don't have drawings. I don't have anything. Yeah. Okay, I'll buy a ticket. Go to New York, draw it. <laughs> <laughs> and that's happened. And that's happened. Yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah. That's a really great story. Yeah, and, uh, and, uh, the other interesting thing is that in this building is the oldest elevator in the town. Really? Yeah. So the oldest elevator in the yeah, town. So it still works though, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, so it'd be nice if you can have a little show of the rooms and then, uh, okay. and then we'll see. Thank you. Share. This is an eight bed share, yeah, and these are seven, seven euro per night, yeah, off yeah. season, maybe 15 in the middle of the season, yeah? 12. 12. 12. 12. 12. Okay, good. Obviously, yeah. last year, no guests. This is the apartment. Here, all apartments are with balcony. With balcony, yeah. And these are 30, 30 euro for the night off season. If the water's running, it's clean, what else do you need? Spacey, very airy, a lot of light. There's a lot of, a lot of windows lets in a lot of light, and then yes, obviously the view, the view, of course. Now you've got the opera house, the main pedestrian street. Yeah. So if you're looking for reasonably priced accommodation in the centre of Varna, 
you should definitely check this place out. I recommend every time that you go directly to websites <laughs> and book directly on the website because the owners benefit a lot more. And uh, yeah, so recommend this place for sure. I'll see you guys later. Okay, so I found a little place, City Boutique. I've seen this one on the internet. It's a three-star guest house. So let's have a look. Let's see the press here. Ah, oh, someone's here. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Uh, my name is Gareth. Oh, come on, come on in, come on in. Do you speak English? I do, yes. Yeah. Um, Hi. I, actually, I have a YouTube channel. I've seen yours on Booking. I thought it looked a really beautiful place and I would like to put you inside the video, would you be interested? Uh, so are we recording right we're now? We're recording now, oh, yeah. Wow, we're, we're. so we're live. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, good. Well, uh, I'm Maggie. Nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure's and mine. your name was, I'm sorry? Gareth. 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 Yes. All right. All right, good. Well, all right. So, and uh, as I understood correctly, you would I like have a, to just, just take have a, a look, look and see yeah, who we are. Yeah, check out your rooms. And, exactly. Okay, exactly. all right. And yeah. you have a That's YouTube couple of questions. channel. I have a YouTube channel. And it's... Uh, Promoting Bulgaria. Okay, all right, good. Yeah, the idea is to promote Bulgaria to people outside of the country right. to show them um, that it's not just about sunny beach and, okay. and golden sands. You know, there's okay. a lot more to Bulgaria. All right, but that. not only hotels, no, the hotel industry, everything, only everything, everything that to do someone with Bulgaria. can see when they've... All right, well, uh, come on in then. Yep. Uh, okay. And I will show you around, sure. Yes. Actually, we have very two very strict rules. Yes. One of the rules is no shoes in the house. Ah, so that's just like any Bulgarian <laughs> house then, no? <laughs> uh, pretty much, yeah. pretty much. Yeah. I know... Uh, there are a few Asian countries that are requesting, require yes. not to have shoes, also hotels. Uh -huh. But this is what I decided to do, to keep it, uh, the quality and the cleanliness of my standards. Yes. Uh, I need everybody, as well as us, yes. to wear slippers. <laughs> and we uh, provide um, comfortable slippers, brand new. Ah, oh, very to, nice, yes, exactly. Okay, so, so that's... Yeah, I'm gonna ask you kindly to please choose, let me see which is available, I think. Oh, not this one. But this one, it's uh -huh, so right it's now. all according to your room. Exactly. So we have six rooms, yeah. and the coatings over here are yeah. according to the rooms. Oh, and we have good. two drawers per room, per room. because usually uh, either a single or a couple Ge uh, guests are our are. guests. Yes. That is okay. Correct. okay. Very good. And the second uh, rule that we have no smoking anywhere. No smoking. No of smoking. Course. We have a designated a small section outside of the house. Uh, any smoker can enjoy smoking there, but not inside anymore. Yes, of course. So these are the two, that's it. Uh, I try to keep a four-star hotel, international four-star hotel uh, quality of furnishings and bedding and customer service. Uh, and uh, according to the categorization of Bulgaria, we have three stars because that is the top for guest houses. Okay. Uh, That's good to know. But stars really don't mean anything anymore, to no. be honest with you. I've traveled all over the world. I bet so it's guest feedback that means a lot to you, correct, no? And correct. from what I've seen on Booking, you <laughs> were the top, the top, I think. So, that is correct. Yeah. For, actually, fourth season in a row, four years in a row. All right, would you like to let me have, show me a little sure, bit around? Sure, absolutely. I mean, so this is our foyer, nice. formal, uh, where the guests usually come. They sit, the business travelers usually sit by the fireplace. Um, and because we have uh, the fastest internet in the country, yes. we use the T1. Uh, they they love to stay over here. Ah, it's a nice atmosphere. Course. It's nice music, and it's usually they're very cool in the summer because summers get to be very uh, humid in yes, Varna. Yes, definitely. Uh, and it's very cozy. This is my office. This yep. is where I work every single day. <laughs> That's it. So then the people I see you also. It feels exactly. Uh, yeah. Exactly. You're not hidden away notice. somewhere, you know, in the no. back like it is in other no, hotels no, no. and things. But it gives some privacy because that's our business center as well. Of course. If the guests need to print out something or they need to work over here as well, they by all means they can come and they that's can do it nice. as well. Yeah. So that's it. Yeah, very simple else. rules. And very of course, rules. because we're COVID-19, yes. uh, the next thing we have a little section over here for disinfection. We disinfect our hands at walking in. Yes, so of course. can we ask you to do that? Yep. All right, so let's walk around yeah. and uh, show the property and what is available to our guests. So I see a coffee machine here. Can guests just uh, come and make themselves? Or... That is correct. That's our uh, coffee area. Uh, everything is included in the price. This is what whatever I show you okay. today. Yes. Just bear in mind that that's been included in the price. In the price. Breakfast area is over here. So yeah. I mean, how we, you usually do it as a buffet here, or we so... have it as a buffet over here, on the plate and. and Pick and choose whatever they want that's to. That's perfect. Yeah. And they can go through it as many times as they want to as well. Okay, okay, I try that's good. to replenish 
we don't leave a place that is empty. Right. Say. Is and what is distinguishing us from big hotels is that I know all my guests. Mm -hmm. I'll, I meet and greet all my guests. We talk about food preferences, any food intolerances, any. I know what time they are planning on getting down for breakfast. Yeah. And of course, I know if I haven't seen anyone, but they've already, you know, checked in and we've already spoken what they put in there. <laughs> Good. So yeah. let's check out this fitness. Sure, absolutely. So this is our little fitness. It's a fitness studio. So you can get a couple of people, a few people in here. I mean, uh, well, a couple of people looking, looking from outside, I wouldn't have expected you had a fitness. Uh, and if uh, business gets you so busy, you really need to work out uh, a little bit just to work yes, your body. Yes, 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 you yes, may yes. not have the option because of weather or because of time to go out. To for a run or So something. exactly, and spending half an hour or an hour just working out will make your brain a little bit at ease mm -hmm. because you've done your part taking care of your body. That's, yeah, exactly. that's the philosophy. Inside? <laughs> I think that's my cleaning lady. So she has a key already. Hi. Hey, hi. hi. This is our cleaning lady. She usually comes at this time. She okay. can take care of the of you know, all your the rooms, rooms, the rooms and, and the house. Okay. Thanks to her, we have full ten. Ah. Okay. And then we have our infrared, infrared sauna, sauna here. Mm -hmm. ah. Very nice. It is two to three people. Yeah. And especially um. with the combination of uh, the fitness and people working out. Uh, we decided that it's a better idea than a Swedish or no, no, really a Finnish one, right? or not the hot one. Yes, this this one goes. The temperature goes up uh, to 50 degrees Celsius. Okay. This is our junior suite. Okay. It has a queen size bed. It is 27 square meters, and one fantastic thing is it has the biggest bathroom, and it's right. 11 square meters of a bathroom that has everything anyone can ever wish. <laughs> and how much? How much would this room cost somebody? All right. So off season, this one is between 69 and 79 euros per night. It yep. depends of occupancy, depends availability. Then in the summer, it goes between 79 and 99 right. euros per night. Yes. So what, what kind of breakfast do you usually serve? Is it like kind of continental or is it international? Or? It is more continental when we have full house. Okay. This is the easiest way for everybody to pick and choose whatever they want because it's rich. And mm. We have three or four different cheeses, including Bulgarian definitely. Yes. Uh, we have two or three choices of meat, uh, then at least four choices of bread from okay. the lightest to the darkest. Mm. Sometimes when we have guests who have special needs, like lactose intolerance, or vegan or vegetarian, then we make sure that we have plenty of what they need so yes. they have a uh, good breakfast in the morning. Uh, we do have organic foods as much as possible, or how they call them, bio. Like, yeah, 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 organic. Uh, our milks, we have at least two different kinds okay, of nice. nut milk, almond yeah. milk or soy milk, but they yeah. are all organic. Yeah. Um, we make our own yogurt here, and then uh, when we meet uh, the guests who are coming, the first thing is I usually ask them if we would like to have a coffee or tea or juice or water or something like that. Yeah. So it's a complimentary drink at uh, welcome. On arrival. Go directly to the, the website of the um, hotel or, or call them directly. Uh, better than going through booking or any of these other sites, the, the owners of the properties, especially the smaller properties, they benefit a lot more than if you go through booking and that. So if you like this place, you like the look of it and you want to book it then please just call them up directly i, I will leave a, a link in the video description and uh, you can call them or you can go to their website and book directly oh well, thank so, you you're that's, welcome uh, yeah that's tremendous advertisement i think <laughs> very well put up yeah thank i think you. it's a thank beautiful place and i mean the attention. reviews and what i've seen yeah <laughs> Okay then, All right then. Thank you thank very you. much. Absolutely. It's been yeah, a pleasure. It's pleasure. It's yeah. pleasure. Thank you. And I will definitely for recommend to my, my <laughs> to my fr friends and family. I'm going to recommend for sure that they come thank down you. here. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay then. It's a pleasure. Let's go to the next place, guys. <laughs> so, if you're liking this video so far, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Give that video support. Share it with friends. And if you've not yet subscribed, don't forget to hit the subscription button. And you can hit the bell for notifications. And I've got one little question for you. When you're booking a hotel. Do you care about the star ratings or do you look at reviews? Let me know in the comments below. Okay, so I'm here at the Panorama Hotel. I'm here with Christina Gueva and she's the CEO of, how old is this hotel? Still 
and welcome to Hotel Panorama. Thank it's you. our pleasure to have you with us. The hotel is 15 years old, so we are one of the first hotels in Varna. Okay. Uh, the only one hotel on the seaside yep. with sea view. I'm happy to see as I've been around. Money is really invested. I mean, it doesn't look like a 15 year hotel. So it's very nice. We did uh, a full renovation two years ago. We invest money in our look, in our service, in the training, also the staff. And how many rooms? Uh, in the light of the rooms, we have 57 rooms. Majority of the rooms are with sea. This is why the hotel is called Panorama. Oh, yes, Panorama with the nice spectacular view on the seaside with a cup of coffee. So I guess that you have mainly business clients. So uh, majority of our guests are coming in Varna to travel and to work. Some of them are coming, visiting Varna as a touristic place because it's a wonderful place. Also, we have holiday packages, we have nice summer and seaside, uh, so we have holiday guests, we have families, we have variety of guests, but majority are business guests. Speaking about the prices, what range of prices are the rooms? The price for a single room is around 40 euro. For double, it's, it's around 50 euros, so it's uh, affordable. You can stay here with a smile. Breakfast looks lovely. Nice kind of continental and international style breakfast. They come in the package of the, the room. Is it included or do you do separate like a room only rate? We structure two kinds of board. Room only, when clients who are not willing to have a breakfast in the restaurant, they can stay in the hotel without having any meals. Generally, our boards and breakfast is included in the night and price that I already mentioned. What would you say to the people who are watching today? Why should they come to Varna? Varna is a sea capital. Everybody knows that Varna is a touristic destination. It has the resource, it has the people, it has the experience also to develop and to make uh, guests satisfied. This year we have a uh, 100 years tourist destination for now, so this is one of the reasons to, to, to be visited. So if someone is interesting, we will be happy to contact us directly. We will try to do the best deals of the day for them. So yeah, like I'm always saying, don't go through booking. Just call us because sometimes we are doing some deals of the day. Don't uh, lose time to go on the website or go on uh -huh. or else. Just, Just call, call and say the best price of the day. It can be even a how. Just so call, call directly. Excellent advice. Okay, thank you, Christina. Pleasure. So we're here at Grand Hotel London and this hotel is a beautiful five-star hotel in the centre centre of Varna. I think we're only about 50 metres away from the pedestrian area and I'm here today with Todo and he's the owner slash kind of manager. Would you like to explain a little bit more? Uh, actually uh, we are an owner of the business yes. who is renting the hotel. Uh -huh. uh, we work uh, in the hotel from uh, 19 from 2013, uh, eight years now. I think how old is the building? The building has a very interesting uh, story. It was opened in May 1912, but uh, one month earlier, uh, here was accommodated the mayor of Paris uh, during his official visit in Varna. The building is very nice. Uh, the style is Belle Epoque. It, it was here, actually, was the first elevator in, uh, in Varna. Uh -huh. The hotel name was Grand Hotel London. During the years, it uh, changed several times the name of uh, the hotel. 1945, it was changed to Musala. Musala, yeah. yeah. 208, uh, the owner of the hotel decided to bring the first, the original name of the hotel, and it was again Grand Hotel London. Yes. Uh, it, for, it was the first Grand Hotel in, uh, in Varna, too. In Varna. Yeah. So the original name was Grand Hotel London, then it changed to Hotel Masala, and then in 2008 came back to Grand Hotel London, correct? Yeah, yeah. What was the original idea to call it Grand Hotel London? Do you, do you know that? Actually, no. No? No, it was uh, a decision of uh, the first owner yes. of the hotel, but why? Maybe the original owner had something to do with London. Maybe. Yeah. So what kind of guests do you get in the hotel? Is it business or touristic guests? Actually, uh, it's a business hotel. Business hotel, yeah. mainly business hotel. Yeah. Yeah. Um, maybe about 90% of our guests are corporate uh, guests yes. who stay in Varna for business. Maybe in the summer, 
mm. a little bit more touristic. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we are close to the pedestrian street, exactly. we are close to the sea, to the sea garden, to the beaches. Obviously, with being a five-star hotel, centralised. What kind of services do you provide for your guests? Can you pick them up from the airport? We uh, offer uh, pickup services from uh, the airport Havana. We have a very nice spa center here. Right. Okay. Yeah, with a jacuzzi, with sa with sauna. Yeah. Uh, of course, it's um, it's a place where after your business day you can relax. Right. Yeah, this is the idea. In front of the hotel there is uh, parking, yep. which is very comfortable for the center of Havana <laughs> yes. to have a parking. I guess that the room automatically comes with shampoos. Of yeah. course, being a five star, yes. I expected yes. this. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Uh, everything you need for your stay, yeah. you can find it in you the can room. Find it in the room. Is laundry service available? Of yes. yes, ironing, laundry services, everything uh, a business traveler needs. Yes, yes. yes. Okay. Uh, the breakfast is uh, also included in, in, the uh, price. in the rate. Yeah, uh, we have very nice restaurant. Uh, the restaurant offers um, some kind of international uh, menu. Menu, oh, yeah. Perfect, yes. uh, the breakfast uh, here is very interesting. It's not uh, a buffet, wow. it's a la carte. Nice. I guess in these difficult times, the a la carte breakfast is a great idea. I mean, a lot of people don't want to be congregated around the buffet. Breakfast and ev everybody can uh, pick up from uh, our special menu, breakfast menu. And I mean, I guess you provide a room service. Of course, we offer. Now, nowadays, uh, many of our guests prefer, prefer to have a breakfast in the room. And is that a, an extra charge? No, 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 so no, that's no. Because yeah, that's great. Yeah. I mean, also within a five star. You we can, do every, everything for our guests. Uh, guests. This is yeah. the most important. Yeah. Food. So, what kind of packages and what is your prices of your different types of rooms? Uh, we have four types of rooms. Uh, we have a double standard room. Mm -hmm. We have deluxe room. Uh, studio and junior suite yep. and uh, the rates are different for the type of room uh, you can choose yes so what would your lowest price be then? the lowest rate uh, uh, it depends on the season also yeah on the season imagine. in the winter of course uh, the prices are a little bit uh, lower uh, and for a double room we start let's say about uh, 60 70 euro per night yep. for two persons and uh, in the summer we go for double room in double standard about uh, 100 euro yes, yes it's an average price yeah of course it depends uh, from the weekday or uh, weekend. is it weekend yeah weekend or uh, during the weekend the week um, what would the luxury the top top room price be the most luxury room in the summer is about uh, 150 euro right so it's not extremely high no, than no. The... so are you from Varna? Yes, you're from Vana. I'm born so you here know Vana very well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. So, what would you say the most see touristical place to go, and where would you say the best restaurants are? The historic site. Right. Uh, yeah. Maybe the archaeological museum. Yeah. You know the yes. oldest gold in the world. In yes. the world is found here. Yeah. About the food and restaurants, the new zone, which is near the Vana port, okay, is very beautiful. It's developing now. Mm -hmm. And I think that uh, in a year or two, it will be a very beautiful place. Yes. Well, as I always say, go directly to the website or to call them up directly. I, I guess if uh, they call you on the day, maybe there is a chance for a, a cheaper price. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. Yeah, so definitely give them a call. If you know you're coming to Varna and you have booked a hotel and you want to stay in a luxury hotel like this, then give them a call directly, directly on the telephone or book through their website. Thank you. <laughs> okay then, thank you guys. See you later. So that's it for this video. Hope it was helpful. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see some tips while you're here in Varna, check out this playlist. I've got a few videos about Varna. If you want to see other videos about beautiful Bulgaria, choose this playlist here. And we'll see you on the next one.